<laughs> Hi there. Apparently this is Mad About Toys, and he's got a good one for you. But before you settle in, go grab a nice big glass of aviation gin. Now back to you, Bob. It's Mad, actually. I don't give a unicorn shit. All right, just as I was about to record my video of top five favorite Batman figures that I have in my collection, I saw this come up in my social media feed. Wow, the Batmo Beast Gold Label exclusive McFarlane Toys says, Hold my beer to the boys over in Rhode Island. Wow. Dropping this amazing repaint, repack, whatever you want to call it. It's one of the coolest repacks I've ever seen in my life. I've never, I never seen any of the pictures of this without that plastic shell. With the plastic shell, I just walked right past it. I, I literally, I thought it, it didn't appeal to me. You couldn't see any of the figures inside. Uh, but look at that you can just pull that sh that shell right off and you got quite an awesome vehicle underneath i'm hoping it's going to look all right with gi joes but it says this thing is incredibly large uh that is 17 inches long 11 and a quarter inches tall and based on the dc multiverse designed to fit all mcfarland toys 7 inch figures and it has rolling wheels. That's awesome. This is all I am looking for in vehicles. Take note, Hasbro. I'm sure I'm not alone there. I just want a vehicle that I can pose my figures in, that I can take some shots and put this thing on my shelf. I don't need tons of de uh, detail inside the vehicle that you can't even see. So... This is kind of what I'm hoping to see more of from companies. Just some cheap vehicles that look cool. Plastic, if we want to customize them, paint them up a little bit better, we can do that. But I need something of value. I don't want to be spending $580 on a vehicle that's going to sit on my shelf. But McFarlane, he knows what he's doing here. This thing looks awesome repaint packing two things that he probably uh, can't sell that well i've seen both of the figure that he's going to include and this vehicle in shelves probably just the other day but put a price tag on it of 50 dollars us and i almost guarantee this thing will sell very very well how much will it be in canada probably about 80 dollars maybe even more we'll see but I'm looking forward to this thing. I might just end up picking up the Batmo Beast and taking that shell off. What does everybody think of this? Are you guys going to be picking this thing up? Have you already picked up the Batmo Beast and taken the shell off of it and done some customization on it? Let me know in the comments section below. But I'm excited for this one. Have to put my top five favorite Batman McFarlane figures off for tomorrow. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell. You don't want to miss it. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you have a great day, and I will talk to you guys later. All done the video.